Hello, Hello and, and welcome, welcome to, to the, the ultimate. ultimate slash J. Slash J. I'm Lynn. I'm Sam. And today we'll be talking, debating really, uh, a matter that's very important to us. So a while ago I had this idea of picking actors I think would make good live action casts for the Joker. And it spiraled out of control so fast. Yeah. Um, so to commemorate that, we've prepared each a cast of sorts in accordance to this glorious event we both have picked an ideal actor that we think would make an incredible joker and we have a couple parameters the first is that the actor cannot have already played a major role in a dc film show video game etc and that also excludes voice actors it also couldn't be scarlett johansson and in addition to that we will elaborate on our characterization of the joker and I think, yeah. Yeah, I think we're ready to go. All right. All right, so I'm first. My pick for who I think should be the next Joker is Johnny Depp. Oh, my God. He's played a lot of roles where he has either killed people or been killed, such as when he was killed in Nightmare on Elm Street. Uh, he's played Edward Scissorhands, Jack Sparrow, Willy Wonka, and the Mad Hatter, which is, ironically, the name of a Batman villain. Um, and he was also in Rango, which I just think is funny. All, a lot of these characters have questionable sanity, so I know he can pull off the unhinged thing, and I also know he can have like that kind of stage presence that's required. And the je ne sais quoi of why he'd be the good pick is really just the physicality of it, because especially, like, think of Jack Sparrow. He can put his whole body into what he's doing, and so I know he could bring that. And so the vibes of this, I'm picturing... Long purple trench coat, short green spiked hair with the classic clown makeup, and he's really like puts so much energy into his movements. He talks a lot with his arms and his upper body, and the laugh would be more of a deeper pitched laugh, like a growling cackle, but it would rise in intensity really quick. Yeah, that's it. That's 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 good. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, I guess I'll go now. Um, my choice is. Ted Levine, who is known for his role of um, Buffalo Bill in The Silence of the Lambs. And um, this was not my first choice. I just want to note that this is like my seventh or eighth choice. I just could not find an actor that had not already been in something DC, which is incredibly difficult. But my characterization of him, of the Joker, would be ideally... British, um, British, and would use a pocket knife, just kind of jab at people, and it, since it's like a pocket knife, it's too small to like actually really go deep enough, so it's just like an hour-long thing with each of his victims, and also, um, like a thick British accent, obviously like fake, like he's American, but like, it is a British accent not genuine also his favorite meal would be toast with beans on it i <laughs> i feel the need to note that despite it not having any relevance to the film whatsoever the hypothetical joker film um i think he would do a great job he's been a killer an insane little funky guy before um he's quite older now i think he would be a classy old British man, maybe not classy, but yeah, that's that's my pick and my characterization. Yeah, so wow, I thrilling stuff. <laughs> I thought it would be worse, but I I honestly thought it would be worse too. No offense, <laughs> you did you did pretty good, all things considered. Yeah, I think overall, anyone that sets their mind to it can be the Joker acting wise uh, yeah <laughs> follow your dreams mutilate people yes um i think that's it i think I we're think, good i think we're good yeah right. i thought i was gonna die tonight uh, tonight, tonight? <laughs> it's eight in the morning <laughs> yeah today I, I i honestly thought i was gonna be injured by the end of this recording but i think I'm safe. Our choices are safe. I think we're good. As long as the Joker doesn't come after us. That's Speaking true. Speaking in terrible British and wielding a pocket <laughs> knife. That is so true. The scent of beans and toast fresh on his breath. 
jolly good morning to all of us. <laughs> All right, that's gonna do it for us this time. Thank you. See you later, hopefully not. Or listen, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Goodbye.